Good afternoon. For those who are new, I'm Dr. Theron Sherman, and in today's briefing, we will be discussing SCP-6861. There isn't any objectionable material in this document, so let's begin. Item number, SCP-6861. Object class, neutralized. Special containment procedures. SCP-6861's remains are kept frozen in a standard biological remains containment chamber. Paleontological personnel are allowed to examine it as they consider necessary. Description SCP-6861 corresponds to the bodily remains of Person of Interest 1860. Prior to its death, SCP-6861 was a living specimen of Tyrannosaurus rex, which, according to eyewitness testimony, was born in February 1809 in the state of Kentucky, USA. Prior to its death, Person of Interest 1860 possessed an anomalous capability by which human observers were unable to perceive SCP-6861's true nature, instead seeing it as a non-anomalous Anglo-American human male. This, alongside its human-like intelligence, allowed its existence as an anomaly to be concealed from the American Secure Containment Initiative until its death in 1865. While at the height of its health, SCP-6861 measured 12 meters long and weighed over 7 metric tons. This influenced the SCP's successful, though short-lived, wrestling and military careers. SCP-6861 would, in its adulthood, pursue a career in politics, joining the, at the time, anti-slavery Republican Party, and becoming a member of the Illinois House of Representatives in 1834, the American House of Representatives in 1842, and eventually participating in the 1860 presidential race. Person of Interest 1860 would eventually die in 1865, following a terrorist attack in Washington, D.C.'s Ford's Theater by Confederate sympathizer John Wilkes Booth, who fatally shot Person of Interest 1860 through the eye socket while uttering the phrase, Six Semper Tyrannosaurus. The death of Person of Interest 1860 in this event led to the loss of its anomalous properties, and as a result, an extensive cover-up by the American Secure Containment Initiative, which would later become the SCP Foundation, took place. A posthumous analysis of Booth's body revealed it to be a member of the species Spinosaurus aegypticus. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.